the wife of farmer Nissan boss Carlos Ghosn, has said he is suffering under harsh treatment in a Japanese jail where he has been detained for nearly two months. In a letter to Human Rights Watch, Carol Ghosn described constant interrogations and appealed for action. Mr. Ghosn's arrest for financial misconduct shocked the auto industry. His detention, which is likely to continue for months, has drawn criticism of Japan's justice system. Mr. Gohn, a towering figure of the car industry, faces the charges of financial misconduct, including understating his income and degraded a breach of trust. He has denied any wrongdoing. For hours each day, the prosecutors interrogate him, browbeat him, lecture him and berate him outside the presence of his attorneys in an effort to extract her confession, Mrs. Gohn said in her nine-page letter to the advocacy group. There has been no immediate reaction to the claims from Japanese prosecutors. Last week a judge said incarcerating Mr. Gohn was just eyesight to prevent possible evidence tampering and because of the risk that he might flee. His defense team previously denied that the executive had been pressured to sign documents, a confession in Japanese app reports. In the letter, which has been widely reported, Mrs. Gong describes the conditions of her husband's detention. She said he is being held in a small, unheated cell and denied daily medication. He has lost weight since his detention, she said, and is mainly rice and bowling last week. The six-five-year-old looked visibly thinner when he appeared in court for the first time since his arrest on 19 November. I urge human rights watch to highlight his case to press the government to reform its draconian system of pretrial detention and interrogation, the letter said. Mr. Goldson's lawyers said he could be in jail for another six months before his first trial is held. No one should be forced to endure what my husband faces every day, particularly in a developed nation like Oppo the third largest economy in the world, the letter said. Brazilian Banato executive was the architect of the Renonis on Alliance and brought Mitsubishi on board in 2016.